How to collect donations in any website using PayPal. Easy tutorial. Hi guys, welcome back. Today I'm giving you a tutorial on how to collect donations in any website that you're creating using PayPal. So let's get into it. First of all, what you guys need to do is you can go to a platform known as givewp.com. It is a free a form builder that allows you to build donation forms. And the good thing about givewp is that we can create forms for free and it it is actually one of the best donation form builder out there. It also allows us to receive donations with PayPal and it can be added as an integration or plugin to any of the websites. For me personally, I use it with my WordPress and it works really well. I can receive donations with my website. So let me show you how to create a donation form with GiveWP and I'll show you how I will set up my PayPal with this form. In order to uh, get started, you will find the option right here, start for free today and it will take you right here. So now you're going to add the plugin to your website, whatever website you are creating. It mostly works really well with a WordPress website. Any type of website you have on WordPress, it will work really well. So let's actually do that. I'll actually do it with my WordPress here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the plugins right here and click on add new. Here we're going to search for WP donations and it will show me the plugin. This is the one give WP donation plugin and fundraising platform. You're going to click on install now. It will just take a second to install and then you're going to click on activate. You can see it has more than 100,000 active installation and it is compatible with my WordPress version. Click on activate. All right. So we're going to start up. Keep in mind that we can create donation forms with PayPal as well. But with GiveWP, there is an advantage at that if your PayPal is not working and if something happens to your PayPal, you will still get your forms and you can immediately change your payment method. So that is actually really good that it will give us more options than PayPal to add as a payment method. Otherwise, you can also go ahead and, you know, just uh, create a donation form with your PayPal and uh, connect it to your any of the website. But if you're using a plugin with WordPress, then we also have a backup on WordPress. And if anything happens to our PayPal, we will have other options for the payment. So here we have to select our location. I'm going to go with individual here and then we have to select what are you fundraising for. I'm going to go with education, accept and continue. Then we have to select country here, right here. So I'm going to select United States. We have to select a state and province. I'm going to go with this right here and our currency is going to be US. These are all the settings that we need to do. Now we're going to click on continue. What do you need in your first donation form? So this is what we uh, are adding different fields or the features into our donation form. We have a donation goal. Yes, I want to add a donation goal so that people will be able to see that, okay, this is our goal and uh, this is the percentage that we have reached. Donation comments. Yes, I would like people to add comments as well. Terms and conditions, I we can add them, but for now, I'm not going to do that. Offline donations, I am not accepting offline donations for now, so I'm going to leave this option, but you can also select it. Anonymous donation, I'm going to go with this option because a lot of people want to donate anonymously. And then we have company donations. Yes, we are accepting company donations as well. Then I'm going to click on continue. So it'll show me my donation form according to the different, you know, features that we added. We added a goal. We added, uh, you can see, we have a goal right here. We have our, uh, this is the form. So what people will see is they will see this. They're going to click on donate now. Then they will be driven to the amount. For example, it starts from $10 and then they can also enter a custom amount. Then they will click on continue and here they have to enter their first name, last name, company name and leave a comment. Now I'm going to click on continue. So we can also add different add-ons to our donation form. We have recurring donations, donors cover fee, PDF receipts, custom form fields, multiple currencies. So I'm going to go with the receipts because I don't want people to feel unsafe. Multiple currency, yes, I would like people to, you know, donate in their own currencies because if their currency is not available, then it becomes a little difficult. And with PayPal, we can, of course, receive it very easily. Then we have custom form fields as well. So we can select it and we have dedicated donations too. Click on continue and it will take you 
to set up your form. Now, the next step is going to be connecting your payment method. Our form is ready. You can see your form is ready. We have created it. And now we have to set up a payment method. And you can see the first payment method we see is PayPal. So here we have our PayPal. You can see right here, accept PayPal credit and debit card without any added platform fee. So with PayPal, there is going to be a non-profit transaction here. And then we have connect Stripe as well. This is what I'm talking about, right? With GiveWP, you can connect your PayPal and then we can connect another payment method too. But we're going to go with our PayPal. So you're going to click on connect PayPal right here. And you can add this plugin to other websites as well. Any type of website that you have. All right. So we have opened up our PayPal. Accept donations with PayPal donations. We need to connect our PayPal. Click right here and it will open up the PayPal for you. Okay, there you go. Now, I will enter my email address right here and continue to log into my PayPal. And that's it. You will click on connect. For just privacy reasons, I will not show you my details, but I'll just log into my PayPal right here and it will be connected. So once your PayPal is connected, you can see we have a transaction type. So make sure to select donation from here so that nonprofit transactions are made. And then PayPal will also get an idea that, okay, these transactions are through PayPal donations. Um, then we have accept Venmo. If you want to disable or enable this option, you can go ahead and uh, select it. You can actually enable this because if people are paying through Venmo for their donations, we want to accept all type of donations, right? We don't want to complicate things. So you can enable this option. Once you're done, you're going to click on save changes and your PayPal will be added to accept donations with Give WP. And people will be able to pay with their debit card, credit cards, or even their PayPal account. So once the firm is created, we can actually do more settings into it, such as the, for example, the goal, how to add a goal, or if you want to change the currency, if you want to add payment gateways, you can do the settings right here with WP forms. You can see, and it will also show you all of the forms that you have already created. It'll show you your donation forms. We have our emails that are being connected to our forms, and you will also get analytics to your form that what's happening, how much you have, uh, you know, gained and what's happening when you will reach the goal the form itself looks really professional and interactive so this is how we create donation forms with give wp and accept payments through paypal you can also go ahead and sign up for givewp.com to add the plugin especially for your wordpress website there is also a pricing plan available and it will give you more features so yeah guys this brings us to the end of the video i hope that i was a big help to you guys don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up leave a comment down below turn on bell notification and subscribe to youtube channel